All right, everyone. We're back with more of Fire on the Four Pick My Ads Mangs Edition, and I am ready to take on Shigal. So let's get everyone down here. Yeah, and don't forget those Dragon Knights. But and those... wait, didn't we have a bunch more people? Or we took care of the pirates. Yeah, but where are the other people? The ones that flank that were in the pincer attack were all taken out when you took the castle. Oh, no, no, I was talking about these guys. Oh, I thought yeah. you were talking about the enemy, but... No. Alright, so let's depart. No, wait. What the? No. Oh, yeah, that's yeah, let's right. Check now, the augury. Let's check the augury. That's, yeah, now I remember we were um, doing the augury. So let's go to this town. Augury. Alright. Let's see. Okay, yeah. They that's just haven't good. They just haven't realized their love for one another yet. Yep. Let's depart. I'm still gonna like you know continue to build it though, just because. Yeah, it's past turn fifty, it won't help out much. Eh. All right. So let's see. And how? It, oh wait, isn't Rakesh's already um, in love with Arden? Yeah, with Arden. Yep. All right. Yeah, we got that taken care of. So let us depart. Sure. Why not? Now we I go. need someone to heal her. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, thousand gold. Eh, it's not really gonna help. All right, so Rakesis, we can move up here. And let me see, Azel, no. And look. Actually, how's a dean doing? A dean promotes into a bishop, right? I believe it turns her into a sage in this mod. Ah, all right. Yeah, I want to get hurt. I want to get as many units as I can promoted as soon as possible. Oh yeah, that's always for the best. Ben's already taken care of, but still, I like you know. It's too bad I, after this chapter, Finn's gonna go. I just for, I forgot about that. Yeah, don't worry, you'll get him back soon. Yeah, still, it's gonna suck though. I, really I like can think of worse things. All right, let's let's see. Chagall. Oh wait. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot the tree knights. They're just gonna come straight for me, right? Yep. And I can just kill them. Oh yeah. Okay. So I'll just and then I guess I'll just get into position, and wait for them then. How's Finn doing? Uh, oh yeah, that's right. I repaired his uh, tomes. He still has a ton of money. And, uh, oh yeah, that's right, I forgot, Rakesis was gold digging Arden out of his money. <laughs> of course. Oh my god. And, yep, Arden is broke. Oh my. <laughs> he lost all of his money. <laughs> yeah, he'll get it, it all. He'll get it back in the arena. You know, wait, <laughs> actually, has he already gone to the arena? Yep, oh yeah, that's right. Alright. Alright. Come on, Draco Knights. Huh, wait, what the hell? No, you're supposed to go down. Not to the side. I see what they're gonna do. Alright, simple. They're we'll gonna just... try to hit at a weak spot, but unfortunately, they're weaker than your weak spot. Let's see, Iron Lance. Alright, then I guess we'll just throw do at the. Oh, wait, we already moved to. Damn it! All right, then I guess we'll just move. All right, let's see how this dude do. All right, well, go Mountain Dew. All right, asshole, come on at me. Wait, what? <laughs> come on. Are you okay? I was about to say, are you serious? Right. Yeah, it's like what happened with the Crest Knights. We're just gonna get around you and then hit you. Yeah, and then we had to unleash Arden and Finn on that guy. Jesus, Eldigan <gasps> was Eldigan was hard. And you got the gold. That's good. Of course. Do I think it's close? I think he's at level sixteen or fifteen. All right, these guys are starting to piss me off. All right, so let's see. Who are we going to give the renewal ban to? Uh. Probably someone that needs a skill a lot more than anyone else, like say Azel. 
Because all he has is pursuit. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Let's see. How does and he we're do? gonna pair him with Talato, most likely. Yeah. So let's see. How does he do with the wind tone? Alright. Alright, good. Let's see how he does. Alright. Yeah. Allow me to teach you the terror of the Thracian Draco Knights. Well, we're ready. You can tell he's into it. Yep. Are you serious? Oh, wait. That's oh, right. my. That's powerful. Yeah. Thracia. Glory to Erg. <laughs> Best voice acting right here. I learned from, from Dynasty Warriors 3. Hmm. It's been a while since I played Dynasty Warriors. Oh, yeah. They're making a ninth one now, but they're, from what I'm told, they're adding open world, and I'm just wondering, how is that going to work with the hack and slash? Hmm. Yeah, I don't. Th yeah, there aren't that many like hack and slash games, and most of them are like broken down into like you know um, scenario Crazy combos. Yeah, like scenario type levels. Uh, nope. Wait. How, wait. Actually, how does he do? Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> how can't I? I can't aim today. Right, I, so I think you drank a bit before you got on today, didn't you? Sorry. I am no. You, no, you know how old I am. Yeah, uh, that Sunny D can get you. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't drink Sunny D. I drink Mountain Dew. That's... Uh, whatever. It's Mountain Dew. I got no opinion on it. Yeah. I've drank in terrible things before. Oh, oh, Jade, thanks. I've drank in straight whiskey. Huh. Alright, do be as powerful as Mountain Dew. Okay, that was actually not that good, I gotta say. He's only level 11, Jesus. Still... I thought it was higher. Oh yeah, that's right. That was what Lex was, and then we, then we broke him. Oh yeah, I gave him the a bow, so now he can rape these Draco Knights. Oh, nice. Yeah, ready see, to kiss her. See, jump cut. This is how you. This is how you use a brave bow. You would have the same response if he was attacking them. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, we can do this. Can she do oh, there we go. That's a good double. Yeah, if she didn't double, I would be like, what the hell is this shit? Yeah. Well, so someone's gonna bow down to the queen tonight. Let's see, Finn. Yeah, let's No, actually we need to give some the noise. She's not promoted yet. And the He's wings too. The wings slayer. Let's see what happens. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. I can barely see him behind the tree in the foreground. I can only see the sword. Alright, so let's see. Where is... Finn? No. Um, Arden? Oh, man. It's really annoying. I can't get to that one Draco Knight. You can use a dancer to heal up, like, to dance on some characters that you want to have go again. Oh, right. So let me see. Do I want. Who do I want to give experience to? I think I want to. Either Raquisis or Azul. Let me see. I think I'm going to place Lewin here. And. Oh, wait, what? I didn't give Finn up. Okay, I forgot to get Finn a state. That's kind of bad, actually. So let me see. I think I'll just kill this guy with Arden. Because why not? Oh my god. Four experience. Alright, and then I think I'll dance here. Yeah, nope. it's the dance of happy joy, or whatever he calls it. <laughs> Alright, Wingslayer, actually. Yeah, we, yeah, we can do this. Wingslayer. Nice. Alright, so let's see. Noisius now level 17? Yep. Yep. So just He's a couple there. couple more levels and he'll be able to become a sword master. We got nothing for uh didn't get the psychic staff yet? Uh no, I don't think I have it yet. Oh wait, I oh crap. Let me see. Jump cut, let me see. Yeah, that he he can use it. It's B rank. 5,000. Let's 
B rank, and let me see his uh, rank in, uh, say his, I think it was A rank, actually. Then, no, not the one. Uh, it's, yeah, he has B rank. All right. Then I guess I'll go and give him it. Okay. Oh, what the? Oh, yeah. Ugh, Pat Belly unfailed me. I'm out here. He's a Pegasus Knight. Really? That's all? He just... All right, so now these guys are going to come at me? No, they're wait for you when you're in range. What? Oh my god. Oh my god, I swear these guys. There's so No, no, as in like you have to advance to them. But thankfully, it's the, those three on the ridge. They don't really go full force. They so, kind of stay there. So when I get into these guys' range, they'll come at me? Yes. And these guys, they just stay here no matter what? Yeah, pretty much. All right. I guess I'll just send, wait, are they, uh, no, they have, ja oh, great, they have javelins. Oh, no. Oh, how dangerous. All right, well, then, I guess we'll just have the dew get unleashed on him. Yeah, I get the ones that need, what's the word, yeah, the ones that need the experience to take them out. So, mostly just Noish, dew, Hadeen. Yep. And Rackus is. Well, Rackus is mostly just healing him for now. It's too bad Azo can't promote into like a dark um, king or something like that. Uh, I'm sorry, I, I couldn't quite hear you. What happened? It's too bad that um, Azo can't promote into a dark emperor, I said. Uh, oh. Uh, the Dark Prince is already a one-class thing, yeah. kind of like the Emperor, where it doesn't need promotion. It doesn't need it. <laughs> I mean, hell, this is this is why no one is an Emperor. They had, he's already capped everything. And then... He died. Yeah, that's... Re it really sucks. Imagine if Finn was an Emperor. With Arden's growth <laughs> That would make Gen 2 too easy. We gotta make it a little difficult. Yeah, that's why Mang's decided to do a substitute run. Oh dear god. Yeah, he's the one who did a substitute run. Like, he just, like, there were some people who actually accidentally got married because of him, and he actually killed off the wives. So, it's... Mang's is now confirmed for Henry VIII? Yes, you could say that. I was actually very interested to see the substitutes, and apparently I have seen Hawk. Oh, nice. Uh, and he's. Oh, wait, that was just one hit point. Oh, whatever. And it's basically. Hawk is just basically a. He's just not as good as he is in the original. How did they make him worse when everyone has the pursuit tone? I mean, skill. Well, he didn't get. Uh, well, um, Hawk. Well, he's, he's still good, he's just not as good. Because, you know, he's a dark bishop. He's pretty sure he's a dark bishop. Alright, so let's see. Do. Actually, no, I want to heal up Noish first. Too bad I don't have a weapon that would be good against a javelin. A good weapon against a javelin would probably be something. Yeah, like a bolt sword would be good as projectile. Oh my god, the hit rate's even worse at when range. Alright. I should have probably... Oh, wow. <laughs> Do it. Wow. Wow. Whoever made this edit, you made it too easy. Oh, what? Seriously, dude? What? And I'll have Noish with the lightning sword to finish it off. Alright, and I'll just uh, place Noish here, so that way the guy next to him attacks at range. Yeah. Let's see... This guy I'm worried about, the commander, but overall, he should be easy. Bye. Yeah, he looks dead to me. So close. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, that's right. The bo all boats are to the three range. And yep, three times. Goodbye, Commander. You just got lexed. Ew, that sounds gross, man. 
Alright, Ruckus is... Oh yeah, that's right. Already engaged. Er, I mean... Never mind. Yeah, that can happen. Oh. Uh, Sylvia? Okay, good. She didn't get hit this A time. 13% hit. Hey, you, remember what, what happened you, last time? Yeah, someone hit you with a 9%, I believe. Yeah, three 9 percenters. Looking back, that's pretty funny. That was just stupid. Like, oh my god. Alright, so let's see. Um, Alright, I think I'm just gonna wait for everyone else to catch up. Now move forward. Come on, step it up! Here we go. I know. Actually, are there any conversations that I need to... Nope. Wow. Not a lot of conversations. Not yet. Not a lot of conversations in this chapter. I do know that at the when you conquer that castle, two of the people that you killed off would have had a good conversation where you would have had the guy bulk. The guy... The gay bull? Oh, man. Let me guess. Fury yeah. was one of them. Juan and Ethlyn. Oh man, I can. You did say I can get in Gen two though. Yeah. Damn it. With Athena or Altena, whatever you, they call her, I think Athena is a better localized name. Yeah. I do like because Seti. It's too bad that in in uh, America apparently his name is Sed. Like Seti. It kind of makes sense because it's like he's kind of named after the freaking god that his people worship. Yeah, but it, now it's a said. What what does said even mean? It, and the Seven? way it's the way it's spelled. Like I don't. I just don't like it. Like I feel like said he would have worked. That's... I cannot wait to get Fury back. Like. I need, I want her so that way, you know, I can get Seti, and Lewin will definitely be pretty good. Yeah, Lewin's a... Don't worry, Lewin. So far been proven good, but it seems like Finn is taking his place because just because of whole city. Yeah, but I mean, like, without that, I, I feel like Finn would have still been pretty good. Mm -hmm. Alright, nice job, dude. I gotta get do a new axe. His silver axe is on, like, eight uses now. Once I conquer Do this you game. have like an iron axe he can borrow? No, he just has a silver axe and that's it. Yeah, like I said, he could use it to buy an iron axe. Okay, let's... Alright, now come these stupid bow users. You're not stupid. You're Ow. just slightly challenged. Like, all bows are 2 to 3 range and they're gonna pick on you, so it's like really hard for me to counter them. Well, they're going for the easy picking. Why are they going around though? Because they want to try to get a better hit on Requisites, most likely. Oh, alright. So let me see. How does Noish do with the bolt blade? Or the bolt sword, I guess. And... Do not attack the bow users. Go for the lance guy next to do. Yeah. Goodbye. Alright, there we go. Alright, I think I'm going to give the boss kill the Noish. Because I feel like he'll promote faster than, you know, do. And just, just now. Saying. Let's, because last time we saw Chikal, he had the missile tain in his inventory, and now he has. Oh yeah, he does. Yeah, but he will drop Bogunon if he's defeated. Oh, wait, no, I'm sorry. He'll drop the silver blade. And so the silver... someone with a A rank sword would like to use it, like say, Rakwasis, Arden, Noish. 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 I'm... I mean, Rakwasis already has the missile tain. <laughs> Yeah, but now she can have a silver blade in case she doesn't want to use it all up. Really? I yeah, really give everything to Akrasis. She's already a gold digger. <laughs> we gave her the gold. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Go Azel. Nice job. So close. But so far. So close yet so far. Alright, go yes. Lex. Kill off these guys, please. Yeah, that's uh, pretty dead. He's getting like no experience. I think they make his armor blue because it's Lex, but I guess they couldn't do palette, like work on the palettes and the 
when they were modding. But they did get Sigurd, though. Yeah. Brave Axe. Yeah. Because just in case they actually decide to go for Arden. They're going to skip him. Most likely. And if they actually go for him, then they're idiots. Just like the just like the Paladins from the last time, from last son. Going for uh... Lex. <laughs> that was so stu- I was like, what? Oh my god, that was so stupid. That the first time I saw a large group of people do something stupid. Oh yeah, where have we seen that before in Fire Emblem? The entire state of Dan. <laughs> they just like, charge. There was the entire state of Benyon. Yeah, Ben. oh my god, Benyon, Jesus. There was... Ellie Wood's disguises. Yeah. Was... Let's just put a cloak on. No one will ever notice. Yeah. And it's like, how do they not get noticed the entire time that they're in Burn? Kind of reminds me in those Assassin's Creed games, like in the first one. Like the Assassin character, he could just put his hands up as if he's praying and walking, and no one knows better. Despite him having all these weapons on him. Oh, he's praying. That's okay. Okay, nice job, Sylvia. Please get some speed. Level up. Get, please get some speed in defense. Magic and res. All right. Well. Well, that's not helpful. Well, the magic, yes, but we need other things. You can't just be a cannon, a magic cannon of destruction. Okay, let me see, Finn. He will definitely kill this guy. But does he double? Go for light or tornado. I'll go for light. Let's see. The light tome weighs five, so twenty-five speed. And yeah, okay, yeah. Never mind. I wonder how the forty percent growth growth would have been if we had done this playthrough on with that lunatic. Yeah. More people would have died. Probably hmm, everyone that I've already lost. Oh wow, Finn got like nothing from that. Yeah. Okay, eight experience. All right. Do 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 do. Okay, a shop. And now let's see if rack. Wait, let's see a defense on rack with this, but. Yeah, have her next to Sylvia. That gives Sylvia a plus 10 hit and avoid in case. Yeah, this guy does 31 damage. Sylvia has 11 defense. She actually has somewhat de decent defense for, um, you know. Yeah. Okay, now it's time to have the people that are defending your home base go up and defend the Medino Castle up north of you. Why? Because after you take this one, pirates will try to take that castle. Oh my god. Oh, this is the beginning. If you're going to conquer a, continent, a country, you best take care of every little nook and cranny. Be like Alexander the Great on the Persian Empire. Fuck it up. <laughs> See that city? Burn it to the ground. See those women? They're your concubines. But they don't get extra helping because old uh, Hector over there is going to be Alexander's little slave boy yeah I, I've I've heard about Alexander the Great being bisexual yeah I actually heard, I actually learned about that in my history class a little while ago uh, yeah but that was the Norman ancient Greece for some reason oh I remember hearing something about like Spartan men would rather be with other Spartan men over women because they said that it's a manlier thing to do <laughs> um oh man it kind of makes sense yeah in a way it's just we're in, in this day and age with like different values. We have different taboos than what they had back then. Uh, wait, when do we get a tilt Toledo? Or you conquer that castle, and then Claude and Tudulu will come up through the, out of the tower. Yep, out of the tower of Bergai. <laughs> All right, so who do you think we should use to take care of Shigal? Noish, Sylvia. 
Arden. Well, we could just use Arden. No, 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 no. Yeah, Arden by the gate to help with plus hit and avoid. Same thing with Rakwasis. Yeah, Rakwasis can stay here. She can also help out Arden just in case. Yeah, and, and they both had stat. Well, I think Arden has a healing staff. Yeah, he has a. Oh no! Oh yeah! No, no, no! I think we sold. Oh, he got rid of it. Oh yeah, we sold it and gave it to Adin. I think. Yep. Okay, that's a good idea. All right, so I think just these guys that are in gray and Arden and everyone else we just send to the castle. Yep. All right. So that even means even the people in the home base, you probably want to get everyone set up. Yep. We'll send. Yep. We'll Except have Janka. We'll have Alec. Yeah. We'll have uh, Jamka take over Alec's duty, and we'll just have Alec going to find the other castle. I think you should have Janka defend the up castle there, and have Alec be a support because you will need some form of mobility for the trying to help everyone else out. So what do we get out of this village, by the way? Plus defense. I okay. think one or two stats of defense, so... It's like people like Noish, or... Let's just give it to Noish. Yeah, wait a fig yet. One defense. Okay. Yeah. And 5,000 gold. So he now has... Okay, good. Yeah, better watch out. Rakrasis might see your wallet. Huh. Oh my god, that, that was... I have to say that was funny that we did at the end of the video the other day. <laughs> Rakrasis is, is, has lost her brother and she has now become the prince of... the princess to being a, a gold digger for the emperor. I told you, the Yug Jewel Fire Emblem games got the deepest lore, man. Oh yeah, the lore on this is just amazing. It's like right. one thing that was even greater is the game even made fun of you when you couldn't let save Ira. Uh, my god, you're gonna hold that against me for the rest of my days, aren't you? Yeah, just probably till the end of this playthrough. Yeah, and then you'll probably do it again in like Thracia. <laughs> no, I'll just hold off other things that you could have done in Thracia. Like? Getting a Gan chapter? You did capture Lifus. No, I did. You didn't scroll abuse Lifus. Gave him the Hezul. No, scroll. Not yet, at least. Use Marty. Marty's dead. What? He's dead. You, you got rid of Marty the party. I. He. I've seen his growth rates. They are not the best. I tried to use him. He was just not that good. But scroll abuses can change all your problems. Scroll abuses can make anyone good. Yeah, even Marty. Yeah, the party. I'm sorry, but Oithen will replace Marty. Maybe. Okay, at least we get Poogie X. Yes. Hava yes, if Oithen dies, I will definitely restart any time. All the way to the beginning. Yes. There, Let's see? Start from level one all over again. <laughs> and Wait, how do we get to this castle, by the way? There will be a bridge. Right here? Right there. Yep. Why isn't that? Okay. Most inconspicuous place that no one would ever see it. Is there something supposed to be here? Because this area makes me feel like there should be something here. Yeah, it's just a peninsula. Oh. That's kind of. The, there should have been like a secret event there or something. Yeah, but we already got a couple secret events at peninsulas. We don't want them to think that there's one in every level. Right, so let's see. Uh, hmm. Get, get Rakrasis up one space. Okay. Too bad I can't trade the Mistleton over to Noishin. And he doesn't even have any major holy blood. Not even minor. But still, he'll give a uh, good gross for the Sylvia's kids and make Corporal, who's going to be a Baron, a good sword user. Yeah. Just dance, because why not? And a dancer doesn't really need much, but having magic from the Sylvia and physical from Noish could help out balance her out. Yeah, yeah, I could. But I think Lean is gonna be a different class in this one. Yeah, I haven't. I don't exactly have the changes with me today like before. All right, Chagall. Probably gonna be a queen. How dare you! I am the king of Augustia. You dare show me such disrespect? Damn it all! I'll show you the penalty for such offense. Death. Alright, come at me, Shigal. 
Uh, oh man, wow. Come on. Ow! Oh man. I call it the Pompeii Special. Oh, yeah. Oh, what? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you serious? No, okay, come on. Man, well, you didn't get. Well, at least he didn't get just hit points this time. I am glad with that. Hey, plus one avoid. Have Rackers just heal him. Heal him harder next time, Rackwithis. Thanks, hey, Sylvia. Watch what, what, what she's gonna do. Look at that. She heals so hard it goes over the health bar. <laughs> and now we can deal the final blow. Silver. With the bolt blade. So you're gonna electrocute him. My, my Equestria. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, the missile tin equipped. Oh. Huh. I'll be. And we get the silver blade still. Damn it. And then you put it into storage, and that's one little supply shop where Anna is. Is there any more? Is there any more flyers? Yeah, in the next chapter, Pegasus Knights. But not in this chapter. Not in this chapter. All right, but in the, the next one, yes. Then the wings there can be sent. And the steel sword you can sell. All right. And now here comes the part that everyone loves. Move everyone up to the top. Something, something, something. Jefferson's theme song. Je the Jetsons theme song? No, Jefferson's. <laughs> it was this one show in the 70s, I think it was. Yeah, the Jetsons. <laughs> uh, uh, Jefferson's. They both start with a J and the end with Sons, so I guess it makes sense. They're the same show. All right, do you think one, one, the... had, one was animated by Hanna Barbera, the other one had black people? Same thing, I bet. <laughs> uh, no, not really. <laughs> They're not the same. Okay. What you got a problem with Hanna Barbera? You racist? No, I don't. I have watched plenty of Johnny Bravo before when I was a child. Whoa, mama! <laughs> oh, okay. So you actually get that reference? Yeah, Johnny Bravo. He was the best part of that whole show. Yeah, he was the only part of that show. <laughs> there was one joke I remember that did make me laugh. It's it came it was an episode right after I watched the movie Speed with Keanu Reeves. Okay. And there's Johnny Bravo watching some parody of Speed where this guy is on the bus telling, "Listen man, if this bus goes over, goes under 40 55 miles an hour, the bomb will detonate. We can't do that." Bus driver looks at him and says, But the speed limit's 35. Can I just get away with that? Well, it is the law. I don't see what could happen. And then it just shows Johnny Bravo watching the TV and then just orange glow everywhere and the sounds of explosions. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hang on. I just want to see what do it has. Does he have anyone? Oh, man. He's had Sylvia dwelling on his mind as of but late. But still, that is nowhere close to the noise thing. Yeah. All right. By the way, I haven't even sent Dew into the arena. Well, I guess you got something to do with Dew. Okay. And yeah. then try to find another axe or have Lex sell an axe and have Dew buy that axe from him. Like the iron axe that Lex has, he doesn't need that. Yeah, I think the I, yeah, I think to a point, strength, magic, luck, defense, resistance. Don't know he would need magic for. Now let's see, he has a bolt axe. What skill? <laughs> what skill? Oh man! Oh god! All I know is that that extra magic is going to be very helpful for oh. Vival. Nice, nice work, dude. He dude it. Oh, this guy's gonna be easy as hell. And then watch what happens. Oh, I was expecting some RNG shenanigans. Yeah, same. And, ooh, alright, come on, do. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, nice, he dodged. Alright, there we go. Alright, another level up for do. Mm hmm. Why do you need... Uh, come on. Where's that me. skill? Is the skill capped at 15? Seriously? I doubt it. it. Better not. 
Uh, okay, good. No, you have to look it up. I must look up all my stuff. Are you serious? Are you, you die? Yeah. To a brave lance. Oh my. Uh. Well, uh. my luck. Ah, uh, I'm so distraught. You could hear it. You can hear it. All right. Well, I guess I'll just send him into the arena next turn. Yeah, but he will be at like one HP when you do that, right? No, I healed him up with um with um Lewin. Okay, that's a good idea. Always heal up with Lewin. Yeah, I mean Lewin's got a... nothing else going on. Yeah, I mean Finn doesn't need it. Plus, he has a physics staff. All right, let's try this again. There we go. Okay. 15 is the cap for Deuce class. Wow, that's pretty low. All right, Thornton, the Great Knight with a Brave Axe. Come on, do. Oh, no, he's faster than do. Okay, well. Then he promotes into Warrior. Okay, well, do just got his ass kicked. For now. Uh. I, well, he's not as fast as the as Thornton. All right, Lewin, level up for you. Hit points, defense. Wow, he actually got defense. What speed? <laughs> is the? <laughs> I think the speed cap is twenty four for um for sages. Oh no 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 I, no! I thought actually I don't know why, but I thought Lewin was a mage or something. I don't know. I was thinking of something else. Okay, this that's fine. Is... All right, let's conquer this castle now. No, not yet. I want everyone up to the castle entirely. Even everyone, the, even the up. even the other guys. Yes. You gotta tell me. Never... All right, well, fine. I tell people not much. I expect them to know by now. Yeah, I'm a great boss, aren't I? Hey, right, see, hit points. A good way of skill. getting secure to level up. Wow. Just wow. The only thing I got out of there that was useful was. It points in defense. Uh, and I of course, the obligatory. Uh, yeah, that's a good idea. Let's see, magic luck. Wow, that was pretty. Yeah, bad. that's a healer level up if I ever seen one. Magic and luck. I don't need no skill. I don't need any speed. I don't need jack shit. But yeah. If it makes you feel better, do when he's promoted. His cap is now 22. 22 instead of 15 for skill? Yep. Hmm. That's not that bad. But seriously, yeah, that's just, your lucky if, number. Yeah, but 15 I feel like is a little bit low for a skill cap. I'm trying to think of why they would do that. I guess they're just making a joke about how inaccurate brigands are. axes are and brigands in general. It's like I remember in like Awakening, the skill stat for Berserkers was low. Okay, finally, everyone's here. Well, the gang's all here. No, let's make a safe state just to be safe. Yeah. Yeah. You're at the club. This guy comes in. He saves your state. What you do? Oh, you know, I should have moved the Dean as well. Oh, hm. uh, well. All right. What's he going to do? Eldigan. Yep, he's dead. Silvel has been seized. Finally. Jesus. Chagall was an ass. All right. So, nothing yet. But first... Alright. And, oh, this guy. Yeah, big news. We got rid of one of the war. Mm-hmm. And there's Bridget. And... Oh, I thought we were going to do some pirate voices. Eh. Yeah, Yo, you can't do a good pirate? No, I... Boss quotes only for you. Get her, boy. Get her quick line. Don't let her escape. Yar. Fine, I'll give you that one. And that guy's going to just go and open the bridge. <laughs> Yes, he just goes up back to the castle. Just oh, what the up. hell? Where did these guys come from? Just, you didn't see it? They they were part of the transition. Oh my god. Yeah. It's... I thought you were going to do him. Oh well. Nah. Oh my god. Don't tell me. What? 
Oh, they move right away? Yeah. Oh god, Bridget. But thankfully, she's got the Belmong. So... But I would have her go over to help Toodaloo and Claude. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. I think I... I think I like her as a Swordmaster, actually. I mean, I have Noish, but I mean, like, that's it. Oh, what yeah. the hell? Are you see? <laughs> hey, you gotta give Toodaloo some experience. I think they actually added more pirates. Come on! Come on, come on, come on! Aren't you done praying already? Wow. Yeah. Okay. Now you have to get him to the home base so he can do the resurrection. Can I just do it? Wait, can I do it from in here? No. Oh, no. You have to be a base only. And at least they thought ahead and gave him some magic. And they actually gave him... Yeah. Actually, how much magic does he have? He has 19. Wow. How much did he have in the vanilla version? I think it's pretty... This, I think it's almost the same. Oh. Alright. So let me just get Hill up the sheet now while I have a chance. Yeah. And press A so we can check his holy blood. Um, Major Bragi holy wow, blood. Wow, nothing changed. I am disappointed almost. Uh, but let's take a look at Toodaloo. She is a Thunder Mage. That's good. Same thing, it looks like, but now let's take a look at her Why, good what, skills. What was she in the original? Is still a Thunder Mage? Yeah, but almost the same stats, but giving her Paragon with that low level is a good idea. Yeah. And, and she has Vantage, too. And Miter, Forseti, Tordo, and Vala, Holy Blood. She is going to be a force to be reckoned with. Um... So, let me see... Thunder Mage... Thoron, alright. And Thoron, I do believe, has the crit skill built into it, so that's gonna be good. <laughs> I think all the... you told me all the Thunder ones have it. Yeah. Wait, do we ever get the Fall of Flame in this game? I hope so. That'd be cool. That'd be the tits. How did you get it in the original? You don't get it. Oh, okay. Same with the uh, Hellswath and the uh, Torhammer Mjolnir, whatever you want to call it. Molnir? Yeah, those um, were the only holy weapons you could not get. Aw oh man, that sucks. I hope we I hope I can get it in this game. Yeah, because like I want a holy axe. Three but of course, this movement? Is... Yeah, that's it's really good for a Sigurd, because now instead of having nine movement in vanilla, he's got twelve. Do you think just... Do you think Noish can take on this guy? Who can't? You're right. Alright, so we'll just equip the Brave Sword, put Sylvia next to him, and we'll just watch Noish rip his legs off. Yeah, have, put, it's also if you have Rakwasis or Arden, put him next to Noish, so that way he gets the plus 10 hit avoid. And she has Adept, nice. And she now has Major Odo and Uller Holy Blood. Yeah, so they switched her from Major Uller to Minor and gave her the Major Odo just because, hey, remember Thracia, where she was the Swordmaster? There you go, guys. Yeah. Alright, so I'm taking... I'm gonna have to move... What's in this village, by the way? Just money. Oh, okay. How much is... And the villager is very upset, saying, Oh, great, now the pirates are attacking. Thanks a lot, asshole. Oh, yeah, that reminds me of that guy in, um... In the... Asia. It, yeah, where he says, Thanks a lot, guys. You, the guys... The bands are not gonna kill us all. <laughs> Alright, so let me see. This guy... Yeah, those, getting some sassy villagers is good. So I remember there was one mod for FE7. I think it was called Decay of the Fangs. You go to a village, guy's like, what are you doing here? Oh, you, you think just because my roof is red that I'm going to help you? Because in the GBA, the red villages or, or houses were the one that got you stuff. Yeah. And then he was, the villager's like, I can paint my roof whatever I want. Don't think you get anything from me. <laughs> and then your character just steals money from him. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so... Oh, here we go. Get to see all these enemies. Jesus, okay. These guys have a 1% chance to hit her. And if they do, well then I have the worst luck. Well, you sometimes get the best luck too. I mean, that 1% finding something in the desert. That was... that was pure luck right there. Low and dodging two consecutive 89s. <laughs> that was pure luck. Even though I didn't want him to. Okay, no, let's see how tough this fucker is. Mm -hmm. Damn grandma guys, huh? Man, why am I gonna take down with the fair? With the big dog here, mm -hmm. Okay. I think they're sounding more like uh, redneck hillbillies than pirates, but... Yeah. 
Whatever. Nice job, Noise. D damn. The, the pirates are all gale. Never lose. Billy? I think no. don't. No, no you, just, you just lost. I'm dead. And, oh, come on, Noise. Really? <laughs> oh, we got the leg ring. Leg ring obtained. That's going to be pretty useful. Oh, come Okay, fine. We'll put the Steel sword. Yeah. And these pirates are going to try and kill. And then you sell those as soon as you oh, can. Oh, man. And this, but watch this. Oh. Wrath skill. Oh. oh. Let's go with the wrath skill. And then you have... Oh, uh, my God. And damn it. Of yeah, course. I was I was gonna put Claude there, but I want Claude to have as much money as possible to use the Valkyria staff. Mm-hmm. No, my village. All right, so who do we? I think I'm just gonna. How does Noish do with the silver sword? <laughs> oh man, uh. are, you, are you ready to see Noish get a lot of experience? But at the same time, have someone with the. Uh charm next to him so oh yeah can, oh yeah Rackus the... oh yeah Rackusus and Arden are gonna Arden yeah so let's see Sylvia Hazel can go here Arden right over here and Rackusus right here oh man I am yep. so ready to see him get so much experience yeah and then we heal up yeah fortify is a good one though yeah but it's a weight I don't want to use it right now okay all right, so Bridget, I guess, just goes and defends the village. Yeah, just like always. Three percent hit. Bye. Oh, oh, never mind. Ready experience, nice. That is a cool palette, though. Yeah. Blue, like a dark navy blue with the blonde hair. It's a really good contrast. And like once again, the bishops look like eggplants. <laughs> And Claude is no exception. Alright, and I think that's it. Now it's time to see Noish kill a bunch of assholes. Go on, Noish. <laughs> this is gonna be so stupid. Oh, what are you doing? I got it, guys. Okay, I don't. Bye. It's kind of funny and Why like. Why would uh... you attack in melee with a hand axe, though? Criticals. Okay, here we go. A one percent. Oh, oh wait, I didn't equip the steel, the silver sword. Whatever, a brave sword would be good enough. All right, level up. Na, 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 na. Come on, something good. Hit points, skill, strength, defense. Oh my god, he got a good level up. He got a good level up. Jesus Christ, what is happening, noise? We're living on a prayer here, man. One percent. Imagine they actually hit him. Oh, nice. Yeah, with all these kills, if he's not level 20, then I'm going to be super mad. Crit them all, Noish. Crit them all! Yeah, fighting Noish is like bad medicine. At least he sent me uses of the Brave Sword, at least, by doing this. How many Bon Jovi jokes can I make with Noish right now? Hmm, probably like 10. Nice. Come on. Okay, let's see of another one. Slash with the sword. In your to blame, he gave love. Bad name. I can't even get that one well. Oh, God, noise. Okay, yeah, he's yeah. definitely gonna level up. Yeah. It's one thing he hangs on to, and that's when he says, "Have a nice day." Hmm. Wasn't right. that like their last big song? Oh no. That yeah. ain't gonna hit. Okay, good. I told you it wasn't gonna hit. Three percent hit. They're finally getting Oh no, Alec. Oh. Alec. Oh god. Of course. <laughs> oh dear. Alec, you don't. What? Okay, so he got doubled. 315, he 315 gold stolen. This is embarrassing. Oh my god, Alec, you suck. He's being doubled by pirates. He's a Get him out of that castle and have him run away. <laughs> I'm gonna give him one level up. He has. Uh, no. Let's go for this guy. He ain't gonna survive, man. Oh, he's. No. Alright, Alec, okay. this is, will be your last chance. Yeah, eh. that ain't enough. No, nope. No, uh, he, he's, he's dead for. He's yeah. a dead man. Yeah. 
We're looking at a dead man with green hair. All right, now let us use the silver sword properly. Bye. Oh, there we go, Noish. Thank you. Yeah. All right, final level up. Very Noish is a merman on that is. It points luck defense. Eh. All right. Well, his luck, I'll take his it. luck is very low, though. I gotta say. Yeah, and now we have uh, like Dew go in. Then have like uh, Rakrasis go in. And then after that, we'll put Sylvia in. All right. Two hit points, strength, magic, luck, resistance. Why are you getting magic? You don't need it. Hey, 5,000 gold. Nice. Yeah, let the kid get something. He wants it. Let him have it. No, I used the missile chain, man. All right. Oh wow, this guy only had five hit points left. But still, in case they try to do a counterattack, hit points, strength, speed, defense. That's eh. good. She's getting a lot of defense and speed. I do like that. Yeah, clearing my ass. Yeah. Is that Finn? All right, Finn gets a level up. Hit come points, on, come on. lock. He's at level 27. He ain't gonna help out much. <laughs> oh my god. Gen 2. He's gonna be capped by Gen 2. Well, probably. Yeah. There's some kooky stuff you keep getting level here up. with this game. Nothing. All right, fuck you, Sylvia. She no. had an empty level up and lost all her gold. Oh, oh man. This is, uh, I don't know what to say. All right, Lex. Hit points, luck, resistance. Eh. All right, some gold for her. Cannot believe she lost all of her gold. It's okay. It's it's just one thing. You can gain it in the arena. <laughs> yeah. Sylvia in the arena. Yeah, man. You can do it. Oh, this is going to be painful. One hit. KO. Bye. And a level up from Bridget. What do we get? Skill. Yeah, that's an average uh, Odo level up. What the hell? We got you surrounded. You can't do anything about it. What are Loser. you? They're not even attacking her? Oh, they're doing what I told you with, like, when someone has the holy weapon, they surround them to make sure they can't escape, but don't want to try killing. Okay. Alright. How is that gonna stop me? It's just gonna annoy you for five seconds before you maul everyone through. Okay, hey, nice applaud. What's a little bit? Nice. To run. Smite them. Oh, nice. That is a cool animation. And let's see the level up. Hit points, speed, lock. Eh, nice. She needs it. Yeah, she's going to need every single bit of it she can get. Oh yeah, I was gonna say something a while back with the Baomong with uh, Bridget. She's doing better with that than what Shannon normally gets when in Gen 2 in the vanilla when he first gets it. Oh yeah, you can say that again. Around all these dark mages. And for some reason, he always gets vitally hit by the dark mages when I play. Why? I don't know, there's like a 15% chance and yet the dark mages hit him. <laughs> Oh man, Shannon, Shannon, I, no, no, not a good substitute yeah. right there, just saying.
So let's yeah, see. Go I, to supply to sell your uh, steel and. Yeah, deposit some stuff. Yeah, and I think then... I think I'm gonna keep them like this. Yeah, but I was saying like you could deposit some of your swords in the supply, grab the swords that you want to sell, sell them, and then go back and grab your other stuff. Oh wait, I can't promote noise here. I just forgot. Yeah, it's good. So is he gonna be hero or sword master? Oh wait, can I choose? We can find out. Oh. You just gonna have Bridget just stand there? <laughs> this is so st oh crap. One of them decides, yeah guys, this is pretty stupid. I'm gonna take out the magic people that are doing nothing. I hope they go like they don't actually all go for um Claud and uh and Tilt Low. Or no. Talato, Tilt you Talate whatever. Talate Tilte? That sounds like some character mascot for Telltale Games. <laughs> yeah, Telltale Games isn't that bad. Yeah, Wolf Among Us was pretty entertaining. Yeah, and the new season of The Walking Dead is pretty good, I have to say. I haven't played that far into those. I uh, The only thing I've played from them was Wolf Among Us. I've only played uh, the two first seasons of The Walking Dead. Mm. And uh, and um, Game of Thrones. They did a Game of Thrones? Yeah, there's Game of Thrones for Telltale Games. Huh. It's pretty interesting. I mean, it's Game of Thrones. Like, what else can you expect then? Um. Fire Emblem? Well, <laughs> this game is pretty much Game of Thrones, oh, the video game beforehand. Oh, they're finally deciding to attack. Because I made an opening. Oh, I guess so. The Myrmidons are going to attack, but the pirates won't. Because they realize they got no chance. Not even the archers, though. That's just weird. That's probably for the best. Probably. Let's check what that second. Oh, okay, never mind. Oh, crit. Goodbye. Yeah, that's a. Goodbye. That Thoron looks pretty good, though. Yeah. It's like Storm for the X Men just came out and aided you. Hey, nice job, Talatai. Jetra got defense. <laughs> yeah, I hear some people call Talatai or Talato the Est of Gen 1. Yeah, she does look like it. She does, She this this is an S, but she has Paragon, which makes it easier for her. Yeah, but it's like, even in vanilla. But then there are some people, like, there is a, on Serenus with that, FE4 rankings. Some of the people I didn't understand why they rank people extremely low just based on having being a foot unit. Yeah. All right, Adin can move on up. Like there are some people that said Medale was better than <laughs> Jamka. It's like if it was about parenting, okay, but as a overall unit, oh, Jamka hero. does a whole lot more. We can class change him into a hero. Okay. Right. Unfortunately, heroes are sword locked in this game. Aw, oh, man. No axes? No axes yet. Damn it. What about in Thracia? I think they can get axes in Thracia. Oh, nice. Then again, Havan can promote into a hero, so that makes sense. Oh my god, he looks so good. Two skill, five strength, two speed, three magic, two defense, three resistance. That five I strength. I think he. No, oh, I know. The speed is 27, not 22. Oh my god, he looks so... My god, he looks amazing now. That 5 strength really helps him out. Yeah, if only the... Uh, the Instead of that grayish-blue armor, it was red. Yeah. So Too bad. A lot, of the, a lot of things would be cool if we could switch a bit of the palettes. Like how in the vanilla, Bridget was a green sniper, but her all the drawings and artwork is her pretty much wearing orange. Hmm. Yeah, that it, it does look a little bit weird. That would be a good mod. Just change the colors palettes to be more accurate. Sigurd, Adin, and Claude can all talk. Oh wait, no, just Sigurd and Adin can talk to Bridget. And then Claude talks to Sigurd. And there's another one. If uh, Adin has a lover and Medale is not paired, he could talk to Bridget. 
It's kind of a funny one. It's like, oh man, a dean's married. Whoa, a twin! This is my best day ever. Bye. Oh, another level up. I wonder what's gonna happen. It points. Fuck, this is. Well, that was a badass level up, I gotta say. Yeah, plus one avoid. That could help out in the long run. Let me see. This guy does 25 damage. Tao Tao has. Okay. I wish he had a heal staff. That I do wish. Yeah, that's the one thing they did not add in, but everything else except that light tome is straight from vanilla. Oh, wait, so in the vanilla he just had a Valkyria and Fortify? Yep. Oh, wow. That was pretty bad, I gotta say. Yeah, and he at had least, to grab. At least here he has a, a fighting chance. Oh, yeah. And the other one they wanted to make sure you use Tailtay or Talto Tilt. They keep changing names. Yeah. They're not even moving. Uh, oh, they're nice. in the water. Oh, nice. She dodged. Dead. And everyone's just being. Weird. I got a good nickname for what? her. Just call her. Whatever. Wow. She got a great level up, so it kind of balances it out. But either way, just call her Pikachu from now on. <laughs> oh, she's using Thunderbolt, and it's super effective. Oh my god, look at how fast Noish is. Yeah, that's the power of the uh, leg staff. Leg, leg ring. Alright, so let me see. Okay, I actually want to go try and not kill all those guys with Bridget. That's a good idea. Ah, uh, fine, Alec. We'll make you feel like you're being important. But in reality, we want you to die. Yeah. We can't let you die, because oh, we need someone to guard. Oh no, I'm gonna have him die on the final map. I'm gonna send him into the pack of the wyverns. I'll feed him to the wyverns at the end. And then watch, he actually does great and takes over. I imagine he actually kills all those wyverns. No, no, I'm actually gonna sell his flame sword. At the, at yeah, sell the flame sword firsthand. Yeah. So that way he doesn't actually kill them and steal all the experience. Then he'll just be a total asshole. Yeah, because we need that flame sword. That's a good weapon. Yeah. I don't know why they just gave him a, a flame sword, though. I guess so he can be projectile. More thunder. More thorn, I mean. Goodbye. Another level up. Hit points, strength, speed, magic, luck. Watch, you got the strength. You like this, you got the, the other stats, though. Jomka is guarding the castle. Thank you, Jomka. Alright, so let me see. Lex can head over here. Alright, let's get the rest of these guys in the decision. Alright. Hey, thank you, Rock Assist. And do, of course, is trying to cross the bridge, but not over too much of a bridge. Hmm. He's crossing the bridge between life and death. What? Oh. What? I don't know why it did that. You think it would have just gone up a bit and then left, but for some reason it wanted to take a trip around the world. That was absurd. Oh, why did you not use Thoron? I thought I could finish him off that way. You thought wrong. Oh, now God. Now you're gonna die. No, 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 no. Please tell me I'm not gonna lose her. Please. Not yet. I'm 
pretty sure we'll be fine. Okay, let me see. These guys are... Okay, that's not good. Oh, and before the chapter ends, sell the psychic staff from Finn and give it to Adin. Yeah, because that I, way she'll be much more useful and get more experience. And in Gen Two. Oh really? Yeah, Gen Two. Adin will pass it to Lana, and Lana will be on Gen Two on turn one. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. She'll be with. Does she join with Oifei? Oifei is like turn two or three in Gen Two. Ah, okay. So she, I get her. I get her right from turn one. Mm -hmm. All right. And other people you get on turn one in Gen 2, besides Celise and Lana, would have been Iris kids. But unfortunately, we cannot get that today, now can we? Oh, now you get a crit. And let's see this level up. Mm -hmm. It seems her best level ups come when Wrath is involved. Yeah, mostly. So that means I have to gamble. And I don't think we can accept those odds. Oh, nice! Oh, I crib with the bird with the bolts sword. If agile, oh that, oh yeah, that's right. He had a cost. That's why he was able to tr attack three times. Yeah, it's very helpful in arenas. Wait, no, I'm sorry, not arenas. That that doesn't help in arenas. It helps in real battle. Yeah, and like you know, uphill battles, because he did have the higher ground there. But why? Hit points, luck, resistance. Who are we gonna pair Claude up with, by the way? I forgot about that. Uh, let me check. I think we're gonna make him abstinent, but just to be sure, let me look Ye up our notes oh, yeah, again. Oh, yeah, I think we did actually agree on that. Yeah. Claude has a vow of celibacy. We can't do anything about it. Yeah. Who are we going to pair Iris up with, by the way? Just out of curiosity. We were going to originally go it with Lex. Or Beowulf, but you decided Lex, and then Ira died, and we went with Adine instead, because ah. Lex will give his brave bow over to Lester. And then all those axes, we would have to just sell, because we can't really use those on a bow knight. Yeah. <laughs> now we have to see if we can be able to create a holy axe user. All right, nice job, Noish. I mean, Sylvia. With healing noise. So wait, I have to get I have to get Claude all the way down here. Yeah, all the way to the home base. Oh my god. Well I'm just warping him then, because I'm not Yeah, that would help out. Yeah. Oh my god. And then have Fury just keep going into the arena. Forever and ever and ever. Too bad that I didn't miss out on building love points with him and um yeah, it's really bad that I missed out on building them love points with them today. I mean, like, That's... in the um, in this chapter. She has the highest on when you first get her with Lewin, like around like a 300 almost. No, I just want to go to Sigurd there. All right. God damn it. Why is there a fence? What the? Well, uh, you they're fighting at someone's front yard. Oh, what? Like, right now, this is first person. 
You're on your porch getting a newspaper and you see this battle happening. Oh, come on, nice. You kids, get off my lawn. I swear, go both fight somewhere else. Alright, now that's the second dead body you have to clean up tonight. Here's the here's the fourth one, actually. Oh, I'm, I'm bad at counting today. It also could be because it's by a village and you're on the outskirts of it, so... Oh yeah, that, that, wow, that's such a nice touch, actually. There's a lot of nice touches in the Super Nintendo. It's one of the best game systems for a reason. Yeah. Well, I feel like home console or something like that. Well, you're gonna tell me the PS Triple's the best console? The PS Triple? You call it the PS Triple? No, Chad Warden does. Oh, really? You never heard of Chad Warden? No. He was what you would call one of the early days of YouTube of an internet troll where he had this video and he had like the most obnoxious while trying to be bawling voice. What's up, bitches? I don't want to talk about the PS Triple. The PS3 is what it's also known as. Now, we gotta play this thing here. It's gonna be better than the Wii, man. He sounds like a pothead when you make it sound like that. <laughs> Maybe he is, but I don't know. <laughs> but then he's like, Come on. That Wii remote look like a dildo. Okay, yeah, he has to be high. <laughs> he has to be. <laughs> And then one of the be other great things that he says, like, w you want to be able to play good games on a PS Trip, not that whoa, you way show up your own ass game. He has to be. I, I refuse to believe that he has to be, you know, he has to be strong. <laughs> Never mind. And Moving on. Yeah, we remote suck dick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe he's not high. Maybe he's just... I I'm not gonna. I'm not. He gonna. has. He is most definitely an internet troll during the early days of YouTube, where gullibility was so rampant. Oh yeah, because gullibility isn't rampant nowadays. Oh, it is, but I mean, like early days YouTube with those YouTube comments. Yeah. It's like people are easier to notice uh, gullibility in YouTube comments. <laughs> it's just they use sarcasm, and unfortunately, sarcasm is not the easiest thing to decipher in text. Yeah. But, yeah, if you ever have time, check out those Chad Warren videos. It is so... People were, like, really upset with him. Like, flaming him and all that when he did the videos not knowing he's trolling. Oh, God, no. Damn it. But it also doesn't help he used, like, the most annoying voice ever. <laughs> and then he was talking about ABAP. What's ABAP? ABAP is balling as possible. <laughs> Thinking back to these original 1.0 YouTube day memories are freaking great. Like yeah. that one guy filming cats and yelling at them. Like one on top of his counter or cabinet mantle. Get the fuck down! Fucking jump! Wow, the way you actually just like, you timed that perfectly with noise jumping up in the air. <laughs> you timed that perfectly. I have to look. I have to find that again. Uh, you have to upload that one immediately. Oh yeah. I'm, I'm, oh yeah. I uploaded the other episode immediately yesterday. I just haven't had. I just haven't come up with a title for it and um, and put it in the uh, playlist. Mm. All right. So we'll pro I think we already know what it's going to be called. Just put in the lyrics for that one rap song, Gold Digger. Put a bit of the lyrics in there, and there you go. All right. Yep. I'll put. Yep. I'll put in Gold Digger as the title. No. No. Like Fe4 PME part. This is this the whole title is just literally Gold Digger. All right, Claude. <laughs> bye. Oh wait, I probably should have talked to him with um. Sigurd. Yeah. Um, Do I get anything? It's out okay. Of it? All that really says is that he knows who's involved with the plot. Oh. It's a it's a plot related conversation, but a dean needs to talk to Bridget. Why? Do I get something out of it? In the vanilla, you would have gotten the Holy Bolt Ichival. Ichival. Or you fell. Alright, Claude. Staff, inside, Valkyrie. Hmm, let's see, Madeir. No, terrible. Bang. <laughs> 
Uh, I've only lost four guys. It's too bad I can't get Ira. Yeah, you got it. The only one that's worthy of resurrecting is the one you actually gave time for. Yeah. Now we couldn't res resurrect Ira because she was an enemy. Yeah, we never got her as a ally. And now you have to get fifty thousand dollars. Where are you going to find fifty thousand dollars? We ain't got no casinos in this part of the world yet. Should I use the Brave Lance of the Armor Slayer against this guy? Let me see. Brave Lance. Just right. be safe. Because the sword has a disadvantage, and I'm afraid she doesn't have enough strength. She doesn't have enough strength to take out this guy anyway. Oh, dear. Um... Yeah, we should have used the Armor Slayer then. I'm stupid. Oh yeah, let's check the Augury while we have a chance. Alright. Is that alright? Yeah, let's see. Wait, wait, well, who did it say? I wasn't paying attention, I blinked. <laughs> what? You blinked? <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's right. good. That way in the next turn, just have... They can just be around and they still go up. But, like, if they're still not have a lover when you capture that first castle, have them talk to each other... They get like 300 points instant love no matter where they're at. Oh my god. Oh wait, they're sis- oh yeah, they do look like sisters. I probably should have figured this out by now. Yeah, Bridget. Uh, I I think Bridget's got the better hair, hair piece. The yeah. headband from an 80s rock group like Loverboy compared to a Dean with a metallic bracelet like she's trying to look like Arwen from Lord of the Rings. What do we get? What the hell? Oh, we still get the U fell. But <laughs> well, that's useless. Uh, what? Who can we give it to? Well, we could have given it to Jamka, but I benched. <laughs> Wait, can we give it to Lex? No. No. Oh, we have to check. Wait. Go oh, to Arden. Unit. Arden. Where is he? No, he's he's got an A rank, not a star rank. Oh wait, he can't get anything in star yeah, rank. Yeah, press A, so we can look at the holy blood. Oh, wait. Now, let us press R or L to scroll through. Like this? Yeah. Mm. If he dated Bridget, we could have had the second gen kid be able to use it. But wait, I realized something. Go back to Do. We are pairing Do with Bridget. They both have minor. That would mean both of the Both of them get Daisy. major. So wait, Daisy will get. And wait, major. what's wait, what's Daisy? And she is a probably a thief or swordmaster. Wait, but isn't, Faval, wait, wait, isn't is Daisy a, a master wait? Daisy's a substitute though. Oh, I'm sorry, Patty. Patty, 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 uh, Patty, Patty, Patty. She inherits. She inherits a uh, Bridget's major Odo blood as well as the Balmung. Okay, so we want to find a way to trade the Ufel over to Do. Okay, so easy. We'll just sell the Ufel and then give it to Do. I hope so, because I have a feeling that if the weapon is not in their class range, they can't be allowed to buy it, but they can like pick up dropped weapons from enemies in this game. But either way, Daisy should be... I, mean, I'm, I keep messing up the names. Patty should be able to in, hold the Ufel and sell it, and then Faval can buy it. Because thankfully, Faval is a master knight. He can do whatever he wants. All right. So let me see. Let's get Sigurd. All right. And honestly, this these, these pirates are... There's nothing else I should expect. It's just these pirates and this guy. Yeah, and he drops a strength ring. All right. So who should we give that to? Sigurd. Uh, Sap sick what? Yes. <laughs> Give all the rings to Sigurd. No, I'm not giving him the strength ring. Think oh. about it. You wanna have a buff fighter or an agile fighter or a dancer? Where there could be Fury could be a good one. Furry, Fury, Fairy, Aaron. Where is she? 
She's got 11 strength. Either her or Rackrisses can make the final kill. We give her the strength. We give it to Fury. Okay, and make sure she uses a sword. That way she has an advantage. Alright, but we have to wait for Claude to, to wake up. Yeah, and use Claude in the arena to help build up. Yeah. Let's see. Um, Dew is level 14. I think I'm going to send Dew against those pirates. Who doesn't want to send Dew on pirates? Oh, wait, how much money does he have? Oh man, if he gets hit by those pirates, he'll lose all his money. And I need him to buy that. Okay, uh, scratch that. Anyone with ranged weaponry. Okay. Uh, how about Arden? He has no money. He's got no money. He's got no grace. It's too bad that we don't, we're not pairing Azel. His wife made him lose his Oh, wait, we're, pa oh, wait we're pairing Azel with Tattletail, right? Yeah. Alright, so then I don't want Tattletail to, Azel to, to get hit either. Oh, man. Um, Alright, Arden. You're going up. Okay, you're just going up against the pirates then. And then he can sell that iron sword for money in the next chapter. Why? He doesn't need it. He doesn't need it, but why not? He kills anything. <laughs> yeah, but get the most efficient stuff, unless you want to use him to weaken enemies. I am. Oh, wait, what? They're not moving? They're set in guarding the castle. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh. Why? Why did they have to be so stupid? All right, bye. Why not? Arden, the seriously? And they do, oh, they do one damage against him, even though he has better defense in their attack. Huh, just like in Gaiden, and in Echoes. I'm so hyped for that. Yeah, that should be cool. Yeah. I've read some stuff, but I'm not going to spoil it for you. About... Uh, oh no, is it plot twist for what's going to happen in part 8 of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure? Uh, it's, no, it's more of story-related stuff. To this? No, 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 to, um, to Echoes. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna, I just know that it's gonna be similar to Gaiden in a lot of ways. Yeah, but I'm not gonna spoil it to you because, like, it's something that, it's, it involves Awakening, that's all I'm gonna say. So, unless what you want me to... What did they fuck up? Do you really want me to tell you about it? Well, at the same time, do you think the people who watch this video want to know spoilers? I mean, no. do you want to tell people what happens in the sixth sense before they watch it? Okay, everyone, if you're watching this video right now, skip 10 to 15 minutes ahead. 15 minutes? That's a little... 10 to 15. Okay. Five, 5 to 10, there. Or you could put a little bumper to make sure when you're looking over it and make it, you could click it to skip. Right, okay. At this time, at the time of this area, I'm going to be adding an annotation to skip to which part of the video. So, there, you have that. Alright, so you're ready? Okay. Okay. So, they're adding another chapter to Echoes. Okay. And this chapter is basically going to involve talking about Grima. For what purpose? To 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 basically um give um um you know talk about his backstory, how he originated. Because Grima in the in Awakening, we didn't really find out much that's, about. Oh, him. that's right. He was around the same time frame as the Mars stuff. It's just he was just minor league at the time. Yeah, and like I feel I've seen his stats. He's kind of a threat. He's more of a threat in, in Echoes than he is in Awakening. <laughs> well, it kind of makes sense. I mean, he was just, like, he recently resurrected. He only so he's he not at full strength yet. But, like, it's like you could wait a year there and he's still doing the same thing. He's just floating above the sky. <laughs> okay, oh. that, I thought it would be worse than that. Yeah, I that, mean... That, that makes sense. So I'm, it's I, just, now we have to see how they deliver it. Yeah, I swear to God, I'm going to, and I'm just saying this right here, I'm going to nitpick the shit out of this part of the game because, you know, Grima, I felt like Awakening Story was not the best. I'm gonna, I talked with this with Zeb too. This was I talked about him in the um, at the at the uh, end of the Order of the Crimson Arm. We talked about this. Um, I'm pretty sure the video's up at the time of this recording. If you want to check, 
Um, we were talking about this, and I told him that I'm going to nitpick the shit out of this part of the arc when it, we, when we come to it, because Grima, I felt like, was like, he was like a superhero villain in a way. Like, he like, like, or like, he was like a Scooby-Doo villain. Like, I, and I would have gotten away for it too if it wasn't for you medley kids in that stupid tactician type of way. That's kind of what I, that was the vibe I was getting yeah. when I fought Grima. And he really wasn't that scary. Still a better villain than Anankos. Oh yeah, yeah, that asshole. Yeah. But yeah. yeah, I could think of a better villain for Fates right now. You want to hear it? I'm ready. It just all starts with the name Mark Sanchez. That's actually uh, hmm, debatable. You see, the it, the whole Fire Emblem universe for Fates originated from Mark's... after Mark Sanchez's head hit a, his offensive lineman in the in the butt. It was so hard that it created an alternate universe. Why in the bu <laughs> Well, there is the butt fumble play that Mark Sanchez is famous for. He oh. ran into an offensive lineman's butt. And then fumbled. And, and then no. the Patriots grabbed the ball and went in for a touchdown. <laughs> <laughs> it is... Best, one pl of best plot right there. Golden. Yes. And then... The whole thing is Cora now has to try to go back to the future or whatnot to stop time repeating itself and make sure Mark Sanchez does not run into some guy's butt. Hmm. See, it's already a great plot. Yeah, yeah. You should be the writer for the next Fire Emblem game that's going to be on the Switch. Oh, I got a good one. You see, it all starts with a Rob Schneider movie. Stop, stop. No, stop. Rev Schneider was he was originally first an animal, then he was a cat, and then a stapler. But now he's a fire emblem dragon. And he's gonna find out that being an antagonist is a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> Rev Schneider is the dragon. Rated PG thirteen. Some movie. <laughs> it's it's alright. <laughs> Like we those Final Fantasy movies on the UMD. Oh. We're gonna have intelligent systems make a movie. Why or can't why, why can't we get a fire in the movie? We got an anime. It wasn't the best. Yeah, and it was only two episodes long. Still, it's better than no episodes. All right, so Thoron or Thunder. Thoron, you want to kill those motherfuckers, don't you? Steel sword. What? Why are, should we be going through the ranged arena? No, bows are the ranged arena. Magic is, like, since it can fight in melee, it goes in melee. Oh, wow. Well, that means the Tattletail is pr basically gonna be pretty frail. Left in the A. But still, Wrath skill, if they do hit her hard enough, she will activate Wrath and destroy everything. Alright, this guy's gonna be an ass. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we tried. Oh, what? We seriously can't repair the Thoron enough? Oh, man. Alright, dude. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, dude. All right. Oh, what? He, he doubles. It's a warrior. Oh, of course, it's a warrior can steal. No, no, we obtained it. Oh. Because he's a warrior, he's not a pirate, so he doesn't have a steel steel. I see that. I feel silly. All right, Ruckus, this level up. Skill, strength, speed, luck. Man, God, she's getting a lot of strength. Gotta like that. Are you, are you sure they've made her to look like Clarine? Because it looks like it's the other way around, dude. Well, I mean, she does have major Hazul blood. All right. Uh, will this kill him? Yeah, probably. 
Yeah, nope, don't want to do that then. I want to give this kill to do. I want to he... make him bleed. I bet I can make him screw like a piggy. Why does he double do? Probably because he's got more speed. Let me see. Thir 40? 13, that's 9 speed. This guy, oh wait, he's playing, oh, he has a hand axe. Alright. But it's like the avoidance, dude's got a 40, the other guy's got a 26. Yeah, it's too bad. <laughs> yeah, you have yet to find one you, dude. You just got here. <laughs> She's already in love with Azel. We're gonna make it anyway. Oh. Yeah, there's one. Oh. Yeah, because she, she just got out of the... Okay, now she's fully healed up. That's a cool... That's Hit a points, cool speed, magic, luck. Nice. That's good. Alright. Oh my god. That guy just... His parents felt that. Oh dear. Hit points, skill, strength, speed, luck. Nice. That's good. And then what should we need? Strength for? Listen to it. Oh no. Well, you never know. You need to have some strength to hold a book. This is get Well, if that guy does hit... Which he will. Wrath will be activated. Come on. Oh, yes! Oh. No. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. Wrath is a hell of a skill, isn't it? Thank you to whoever made this edit. No, Wrath was in vanilla. I know, but still. It points speed, luck, but I mean, like, all Thunder Magic has built in crit. Has the crit skill built in. Mm. Alright, this is gonna be a bitch. Yeah, do you think you can take out Keller? Penn and Teller's a what? double study? And. Damn it. Oh well. Well, oh, hey, got let's far. Let's try again. Oh. Okay, well, wow, she doesn't even kill him. At least you can th repair the Thoron. No. Struggling with buttons there? Yeah, a little bit. Alright, so let's go to town with Claude. <laughs> no, not the armory, I meant the pawnbroker. And. Oh, what? We don't. God damn it. We don't even have a heal staff. Oh, you will soon. Oh, wait, it cost me 30,000, not 50,000. I thought you just told me it was going to cost 50,000. Yeah, it does cost 50,000 to repair it, shouldn't it? No, it costs 30. It costs 30,000? Yeah, I'll oh, show you. I'll be. That's yeah. a lot better. Yeah, see? Take a look. Well, I feel silly. You think uh, giving 7,000, it would fix like a fraction of it? That way you can like resurrect a fraction of the person? <laughs> think about it. Just like re resurrect like, one, like half of the person's body. Oh. Yeah, it's just the legs, and it's just walking around, kicking things. Beowulf used kick. It's, it missed. No, they just resurrect Beowulf's horse, and Beowulf's head is the horse's head. So he's a he's like a centaur now. Yep. We're getting to some Shining Force levels of stuff here. Yeah, if you haven't played th that strategy game series, I definitely recommend checking them out. Oh, really? What, is, is, what, what console is it for? Sega Genesis. Oh. That oh, so sorry. like an emulator for that. Oh well, this is gonna be pretty trivial. Oh dear, I wonder what's gonna happen. Uh oh, God, Claude. Here we go, Claude. Oh, be what? like John Claude Van Damme and fuck him up. Oh, nice job, Claude. Yeah, you can dodge. Now try it again. Come on, Claude. Did they give him any other type of skills besides pursuit? Uh, nope. Not really, I think. Huh. Oh, come on. Please. Hit it. Hit, hit the guy who... Okay, finally. The guy who looks like a Batman villain. Hit him. Okay, this guy's gonna be an ass. Yeah, you're gonna get... You're, I don't think so. 
Oh my god, Keller. Helen Keller, what is wrong with you? Yeah, how does it feel to lose to lose to an enemy with a brave lance that can't see you, can't hear you, and you can't talk back to him? How does it feel to lose to someone like that? I don't know. It's like losing to Odd Job and Goldeneye. It just isn't right. If you you've played Goldeneye? No. Yeah, it was one of those N64 games that everyone's like, this is amazing. Oh, nice. You tanked him. Good. Now do it again. Oh, are you? Of course. <sighs> My of course. God. Aaron, I'm trying to... But either way, with uh, Goldeneye, there's like, it's pretty much the multiplayer is just a bunch of various characters from the Bond movie series. The James Bond? Yeah. Oh, nice. One of them is Odd Job. The difference is that Odd Job uh, is half half the height. Oh no! Crap. Um, we had a safe state before that, right? Oh my God! Are you serious, dude? <sighs> Continue. Yeah. That was just shit. He critted him twice. That's the hand axe. And let's be sure. Let's look at Aaron and Claude to make sure they how far they got into the. The arena. Baron and Claude. Claude was up to the um. If he gets to Keller, that's as far as he can get. But the RNG might be the arithmetic might be different now. Yeah. Oh man. Right. So continue while I just speed this up. Oh yeah. For experience, Jesus, Claude. Too bad I really want him to get out of a lot of gold so that way he can um, repair the uh, resurrection stuff. Okay, nice job. Oh, Claude. Of course. No, I don't want to do that. Yeah, it's okay. Alright, let's try this. I didn't know Pegasus is nice good tank. I thought that was exclusive to only armor knights. You mean the uh, critical? Or tank? Yeah. You... I think she Are might you... have the great shields. I think she might have the great shields skill. Oh my god, Aaron, why can't you just hit the damn guy? But oh yeah, that's she... hard. Yeah, she has puff eyes. Yeah, that's the tink thing. Yeah. They gave her that. I think in case, like, ballistas or whatnot, they added that. Yeah. But, of course, that doesn't help out in the long run. Yeah, because we, we see how that helps. Nice job. Oh, wait, this is Thunder. I thought I was using Thorn. It doesn't matter. I still killed him. Blood and Thunder. It don't matter. Hey, wow, wow, she got defense. She always gets defense, doesn't she? No. She gets defense in my heart, at least. <laughs> Bye. Are you serious? Oh my god. Because why? <laughs> yeah, sometimes the Fire Emblem game series, it's just a middle finger sometimes. Yeah. But it's a good middle finger. It's one that makes you think, I'm going to grab it and shove it up your nose someday. Like the, uh, this, the existence of Dew. I swear to God. Don't. So a bow user would be really helpful. Oh yeah, let's use Lex. Yeah. Don't. Okay. No! Um, what happened? Um, oh. And Lex got the power ring. 
Oh, he can sell it in the next level, which then gives him 20,000. Uh, man, this episode... So everyone's is... all uh, taken care of with, like, skills and whatnot? Oh, wait, we have to have... In the um, arenas. Richard talk to, um... Secret, it's kind of, uh... No. No. Okay, wait, okay, wasting another turn. No. Whatever. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Hey, Bridget. I lost my wife. How about you be mine? We're gonna sit next to each other for a good 50 turns. I think that can be helpful. Does Claude... Does Claude give anything to Sigurd? Your... It's mainly just plot related. Okay. But still, you never know. You might want to talk. It might be interesting. We'll talk later. But I got something important to tell you. Oh, what the hell? What? Oh, yeah. This is great. Look at this. It looks like an evil Santa Claus. And then the next guy. Well, it looks like Jumka's screwed. Oh, but it gets even better. Look over here. It's Colonel Clink. <laughs> Colonel Clink from Hogan's Hogan! Heroes. Hogan! <laughs> oh, come on. I can't believe you've actually watched that show. When I was a kid, my parents let me watch TV Land too much. <laughs> Hogan! Hogan! Here's a story of a man named Sigurd. He was in a lot of, of a hunch. So wait, what happens now, though? You're now realizing that your wife's gone, you're branded a traitor, everyone's coming to come out to kill you, and then, what is this? Who's it's this? Aaron's sister. Older oh, really? sister. And I don't get it I don't get her as a recruit. No. Not even in Gen 2. No. Oh, what the she's hell? She's a she's supposed to, I don't want to spoil much for her, but uh she kind of starts a minor archetype in the Fire Emblem series of the uh a certain NPC that's friendly to you, helps you out a lot. And then kind of does nothing else. All right. I don't want to spoil too much for you, but let me just give you a hint. Lila. Oh, God. <laughs> so, yeah. Does that, mean Layla? Layla, Lila. It, right, it now I have to listen to Eric Clampton again, but yeah. That archetype. The, oh, I think I can recruit her. You can't. I think I've heard this. Recruit the dead. I, I think I've heard this music from in Fire Emblem 7. Yeah, there was a, uh, on a bonus disc, I believe it was, or a bonus track, they had that in FE7 as a bonus track. Yeah, I've heard this. Yeah, I've heard this song before in FE7. And yeah, it's, it's kind e of a cool Easter leg. I mean, e Easter egg, not Le Easter. Leg? Wait, there's a, e yeah. wait, wait, you can have an Easter leg? I didn't know that. You, you first have to shoot the Easter bunny and kind of <laughs> eat him. Yeah, and then you get the leg. Yeah. Yep, Sigurd, you'll be Renaya with your um, with your wife someday. Just not the way you think it is. Look on the bright side. It's gonna be a great way. I can see. I can, I can see it now. Oh no! Thanks for. Oh, we forgot to take all his items off. Oh well, you'll oh. get them soon. No, you get them back. But he, what about the Forseti tome? He will have it. He gets to keep it. So. Goodbye, Finn. Damn it. Well, not just that, but like all those items that we forgot to take off of him. But the, hey, this the, will make the level fun unless you go back to the original save state. No. The, so the magic ring, the Forseti tome, <laughs> the tornado tome. Yeah, all that coolio stuff oh, is now gone, oh. Thank you. Oh. Until you, Gen 2? Yep, when he comes back. Which will be chapter seven. So you just chapter. have to go through. You just have to go through one Gen two chapter, and he's back. And oh my god, <laughs> Maos has the he has the tornado tome. That's a great middle finger to me. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of wind magic in this level. Oh really? Yeah. So uh, one thing I like oh, about wait. this level is the music is very. What's the word they call it? cozy? Yeah, it uh, does seem cozy. Winter music in video games seems to do that. I mean, it does sound kind of relaxing. All right, yeah, so... which is kind of funny because you're in the middle of a civil war. Yeah. All right, so let's go to town with Bridget and let's sell the Ufel, I feel. Yeah, let's sell that Ufel.
Oh man, a recover. Recover staff. is a good staff. Let's fix the so bow one. Keep that. We get no money out of this. Oh no, we did. Oh wow. And yeah, let's just give her that thief sword, cause why not? Mm-hmm. You never know when that could be useful. You could also get Noish's steel sword and sell it. Bye. Oh, uh, wait, we're still recording, aren't we? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so Lewin. And let me see, where is Fury? Alright, Arena. No, no, Brave Lance. Oh, come on. Okay, thank you, Aaron. Jesus Christ. Okay. Are you serious? Aaron. Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. That's all you ever talk about. Uh. I jump kick and guard it this time, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Wait, can well, she? Wait, he can, can she... be useful against the Pegasus Knights now. Oh wait, she can talk to Azel. Yeah, in fact, that gets her some stat ups and some love points. Oh, nice. All right, so wait. So then... since we're gonna go that route, I mean, so can... together. Oh wait, Sigrid can still talk to Claude. Yeah, but it's a different thing about like, hey, dude, I heard what happened, but uh, it's cool, man. We we can clear the name, dude. Just, 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 don't, don't fret, man. Who we'll find your wife someday? All right, and Arden is just going to trample through the arena to get back his money that Rick has just stole from him. Don't forget to sell like the power ring off of. Wait, no, that's Lex that has to sell it off. Why? <laughs> this is so stupid. It's always a good call. I mean, what's Arden gonna do? That's all he can do. He might actually cap luck if this keeps up. Oh. He could. I think he could actually cap luck. I didn't know that we were fighting Mage Knights already. Yeah, you can fight a lot of things. Oh, wait, don't we get Seti as a Mage Knight? Yeah, that's what I was originally planning because of the noise thing. Yes. That way. 2% hit. But instead, it looks like we're just gonna get whole city on wheels. Hey, hey, ain't nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I'm not saying it's a bad thing, I'm just saying... I was just thinking... Mage Knight that can also fight good on hand, on hand. Instead of page by page. Oh, come on! Thank you, Arden. Jesus. This is truly the greatest day ever. Atlas. Someone, someone who has, someone who has managed to fight Arden actually. Well, there was, what was Eldigan, but that he that, almost defeated the God Emperor. Finally. Yay! All right, Arden. Da, 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 da. He'll be Wait. one point off from capping luck. Aw, oh, dang it! Still, uh, that is very impressive. Yeah, he'll have 29 luck, but he'll definitely cap hit points. I, it, yeah, he'll, because I think the cap for hit points is 80 in this game. Yeah, and with him and then the plus 60 of what his original growth is. A uh, what? I can't... You don't have enough for that shit. All right, Lex. Come back when you got money. Lex, Lex, where are you? Lex, yeah, I don't think he's got any money. He has to sell that he power has two, ring. He has two thousand. Sell the power ring. Sell the iron axe and yeah, and power ring. 
I sold the hand axe too because I want to give um I want to you know give to do do something else besides just that. Good idea. Iron axe, hand axe. Let me see, Adeen. Oh, no, no, wait, I want to give some money to Adeen. There we go. And now he is completely broke. No, not this. Right, so let me see, Sylvia. All that Sylvia needs is a good lover, and his name it's is John Bon Jovi. <laughs> Enough with the John Bon Jovi. Oh wait, isn't well, Fire? How about he stops looking like him, and then I'll stop. Wait, isn't Fire get good against Wind? Yeah, I believe so. And then Lightning is good against. Oh fire. my God, she gets good. And too. then Wind is good against. Lightning. Oh my god, don't get hit by all these Sylvia. Come on. She's Come got on. a miracle skill, so this should help her out a bit. Okay, good. She actually managed to live. That guy was too good. Damn it. No way, Arden already went into the arena. Um, let's see, do I guess can go into the arena? With the silver axe. Oh my god, this wind mage is this is annoying. Yeah, He's got too much luck. Must be Nolan disguise. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. All these freaking continues. Oh dear. Oh, uh, well. Well, wow. he tried. Wow. Dude didn't get Realize... one hit on him. That's kind of sad. Alright, let's send Claude in. My god, this guy is too fast. Wait a second. Too fast. Sonic the Hedgehog in disguise, you must stop him. We stopped him. Claude did. Well, finally someone stopped him. Now let's check his level up. Pretty good. Yeah, that's a good one. He needs speed. These guys are really fast, I gotta say. My god. Okay. okay. Well, you're in a land where the Holy Blood makes you have like a 90% speed growth. So it kind of makes sense that everyone in this country can also speed growth. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> oh my gosh, I just noticed the hit rate. Yeah. That was just, that was terrible. And was that like the first person in the arena? Yes. And that was That is impressive. That was Tattletail. Oh my. All right, let me see. I guess I'll send Alec no. Yeah, why not? Prepare the flame sword, Alec, and go into the arena with what you can do. And then after this, I'm gonna sell the flame sword. Oh my god, Alec! I can do it, guys. Just trust me, I can do it. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, no, uh, yeah, no, uh, yeah. Fine. Okay, yeah, I'm selling the flame sword. <laughs> yeah. And Alec can stay here with Jamka. Maybe build the maybe build a bro relationship or something. And they have a baby through a test too. <laughs> See Alec, this is how you fight. Take a page out of Noish's book. And that's why he's also becoming a father, and you're not. Whoa, that's a cool one. And let's see. Let's okay, see. good. He's getting locked. That's probably the best level up in the entire history of that character's lifespan. Seghor the Forest Knight. All right. Yeah. Seghor the Forest Knight. 
You cannot stop me. I am oh powered my. by the. My God, noise. Noise is choice. Yeah. Oh my God, that's a good one. Oh, Nikita the Brave. Brave sword. Okay, good. Oh, Tink. Did they make that a class skill for Pegasus Knights? I think so. That is going to be very tricky in this level. Oh, wait. Oh, They're yeah. They're going to make this level a lot harder. Oh, my God. Noise. <laughs> he cannot stop. Okay, good. I am glad uh, that he is. He has been getting a lot of luck, though, because his luck is sucking. I gotta say, as he was struggling when you first started this, but now he's... It's like... He's working better now. Yeah, I mean, I'm glad I decided to use him over Alec. I was like, Alec, I don't know what happened, but it happened. Oh, God. Ow. There we go. No one can stop me, not even Atlas, and he holds the sky up. Oh my god. Alright, so next up is Azel. Alright, Azel, come on, prove this. Okay, good, he's faster than this guy. Here we go. Hit points, strength, speed, magic, res. He capped magic. Alright, good. And he got a good speed, because he needs speed. Uh, alright. And... Was that everyone? No, no, he's, oh. um, I think, I, I want to send him further into the arena, but I want him to, he's about to cap his, um, his money. I see. No, I don't want you being, dwell having, dwelling on Sylvia as of late, Hazel. Hmm. Don't worry, a couple turns with tilt, tilt, tilt you and everything will be saved. Let me see, so this guy's gonna go for this village, and then, oh great, this village, and this village. Yeah, I was just gonna turn span a little bit, but it seems like I can't do that in this map. Yeah, so I think I have to capture that castle to the north, then this one, and then I have to capture this one. Yeah. And that's the map, yeah. alright. Oh, there's other stuff too, but it's easy to understand, and this map, let me get this up for what type of cool things you can get here. Can I get something? One village has something special. What is it? Is it a holy weapon? No, but it's something helpful for Sylvia and Vanilla. First, let us look at the villages. Alright. Up. Oh. And more to the right. More to the right. More up and then let's look to the right just to be sure that's the right one okay press start okay on start and it's the one to the left that village is the one with a special thing sylvia goes there and she in vanilla gets a sword that gives her plus seven defense oh nice that'll be useful for her yeah it would be more helpful for sigurd because you have to equip the sword yeah I mean, Sylvia... Actually, Sylvia has decent defense right now. She has somewhat decent defense. Alright, so... I take it that... Let me see how we are. Yeah, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Oh, uh, that's a good idea. That way we get some stuff prepped. Yeah, and I'll just do the arena grinding off soon. Alright, guys. Thank, okay. you, thank you so much for watching. Thank you if you decided to... Don't complain to me about the Echo Spoils that were earlier on in the video. Thank you all so much for watching, and see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.